So if you are a fan or a subscriber of the channel and you have been keeping up with us here at Digital Technologies, you notice that I use this particular VPN all the time when it comes to getting free USA numbers. Now this VPN is a great and solid VPN and it will get the job done. However, in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how you can get access to a different VPN, which is actually a paid VPN. But in the true spirit of digital technologies, we are going to show you guys how you can get this VPN for free. So before I even get into that part of the video, I want to take this moment to explain to you guys what a VPN does and reasons why most people decide to get VPNs. Now, I want to take you guys back to a scene in a favorite movie of mine, which is the Harry Potter series, especially the first one, the Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. Now, if you quite remember, you see the scene where Harry, Hermione and Ron were making plans on how they can try and steal the Philosopher's Stone before Professor Quirrell gets to it. Now, you remember how they got from their dormitories all the way down to the basement where Fluffy was guarding the trapdoor? You remember what they used? They used an invisibility cloak, right? They used an invisibility cloak to protect themselves and make themselves invisible and sneak all the way from their dormitories down there. So I want you to think of that invisibility cloak like a VPN because that's exactly what a VPN does. A VPN keeps you invisible from prying eyes on the internet. Okay, it keeps you completely anonymous from everyone else and it encrypts your data so that no one at all can keep track of what you do, not even your internet service provider. Okay, so that's basically how a VPN works. A VPN keeps you digitally anonymous and private and it allows you to still do whatever you need to do, which is maybe download movies or even surf the internet and do your regular day to day activities on the internet. All right, and there are so many reasons why people get VPNs. I mean, the primary reason is just to stay anonymous. A second reason is probably to bypass geo restrictions. Maybe they want to access content in a different country, which is not available in their local country. A third reason is probably to access block websites. Maybe there are certain pages and websites that are blocked in their country, but you can use a good VPN to get access to those websites. And last but not least, just to stay safe when they are using public Wi-Fi. Trust me, if you are using a public Wi-Fi or you're in a public space and you connect to a Wi-Fi, please make sure you have a VPN turned on and to save you in the long run. Otherwise, you might regret it. So that's basically what a VPN is and that is the reason why most people get VPNs. Okay, so in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how you can get the paid VPN for free. Alright, think of it like your invisibility cloak. It will keep you safe and you can browse the internet and do whatever you need to do. So in future videos, if you see me using this VPN, just know that it's a great option. So without wasting much time, let's get into the tutorial. Okay guys, so the first thing you need to do is open your App Store or Play Store. I want you to keep in mind that this um, VPN is available on both Android and iOS. So open your App Store or Play Store and then search for ESET Home and download it. Okay, so after downloading the app, you can open it. Okay, so after opening the app on this page, we need to create an account. So go ahead and tap on that button. Select your country and tap on continue. Now, enter your email and your password. Now guys, for the email, we are going to use the temporary mail service that we used in the previous video so head over to your browser and open a new tab and search for temp email when you get your temporary email copy it and go and paste it in the space provided and create your password also when you are done tap on the continue button now that you are logged in, tap on the continue button again. Over here, choose any of the authentications that work for you. I'll go with the pin option. When you are done with the authentication, tap on the continue button. So after creating your pin, now you need to allow 
or skip notifications. Um, I'm just gonna skip it because um, I don't need any notifications from them. Okay, so now we need to verify our email. So head on over back to temp email, scroll down to your inbox and verify the email. In the email that was sent to your inbox, when you open it, you should see this confirm registration button over there. Go ahead and tap on it and that will help you verify your email address. When you see this pop up on your screen, tap on open. Okay, so now our account and our email is verified. So moving on, tap on the get started button. On this page, choose the second option, try ESET for free and then tap on the continue button. So I want you to select the second option, which is protect your small business. After doing that, tap on the continue button. And just like that, our free trial has been successfully activated. Now on this page, I need you to click on the second option and tap on continue. So for this page, you are just going to be displayed some information about your account, which includes your activation key. But for now, you don't need the activation key. Rather, I want you to focus on the menu over there and choose the first option that says overview on your left. On the overview page, I want you to scroll down until you see features. Okay, so when you get to the features section, I want you to tap on the button that says security features. On the security features page, tap on VPN. Over here on this page, you should see your email listed over there. Go ahead and select it and tap on continue. Now over here on this page, you are giving us the option to select the number of devices that we wish to protect. The highest you can do is 10, so enter any number between 1 and 10, I'll stick to the number 10. After doing this, now tap on the button below to send the instructions to your email. Now switch over to your inbox. and locate this email over here, which has your setup instructions. Now, when you open this email, it will give you a list of VPN activation codes that you can use. So at this point, we switch over to our app store and we are going to download this VPN. The name of the VPN is called ESET VPN. Okay, so after downloading the ESET VPN, I want you to tap on the open button to open it. On this page, you just tap on continue. Now over here, they are asking us to enter the VPN activation code, which is a 10 character code. Now we've already generated those codes earlier. I don't know how many codes you generated, but I generated 10 of those codes. And that was what we received in our email. So just switch over to your email copy any of those codes and go and paste it over here. Now, I want you to keep in mind that these codes that we have generated are single use, which means they can only be used one time. And also they expire after 24 hours. That means that if you generate these codes and you do not use them after 24 hours, they'll be expired. And the only way you can get fresh codes is if you pick another fresh email and come and create a new account and generate a new set of codes that you can use okay so when you place them on the space provided tap on the activate button okay so just like that you have activated your ESET VPN so go ahead and connect to any server of your choice And since it's our first time using this VPN, your device is going to have to do some backdoor configuration before we can connect successfully.
And as you can see, just like that, we have been connected to the VPN. Allow me to take it a step further and show you guys this website or platform that allows us to check how protected or how encrypted or disguised we are on the internet. So open your browser and go to this website over here. I'll leave the link in the description. The name of the website is called Hua. And this website, if you open it, will allow you to access the strength of your VPN to know exactly how well protected you are on the internet. So if you open the website and you check it, as you can see mine over here is giving me 90% disguise. So a good VPN will always give you at least 90% or higher. Fairly good ones will give you about maybe 80 or maybe 85, which is also good. But anything below 80 is not really the best and I would recommend you avoid those ones if I mean you want to do much more complex stuff on the internet. So there you have it. Now if you watch the tutorial from the beginning to the end, you should have access to your paid VPN for free. Alright? So please make sure to share this video with someone else who needs access to a very good VPN. And don't forget to leave me a like on the video if you found it useful. And also subscribe to the channel turn on notifications so you don't miss content like this anytime I upload. I'll see you guys again. Peace.